Hey folks, welcome back to Aloft. Just looking at the sunrise over here. That is quite the view. It is. Good clouds. Um, walking in from our gangplank into the goats. One, I figured out these guys a little bit better. I decided rather than trying to combine them into one, I went ahead and made, uh, made proper curtains or draperies or, yeah, window coverings. And two, these guys crap a lot. <laughs> oh, the manure. I'm starting to wonder if it's worth it. Especially since I just discovered that you can put leaves into the composter and one leaf gives you one soil. It's like practically free soil without having to clean up the poop. So, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm starting to wonder if, uh, if this is worth it. <laughs> we may have to, uh, I don't know, donate a few goats to the next island. We'll, we'll see. We'll have to, we're going to keep Amari no matter what, though. But, um, I don't know. Hey, you just might be, uh, might be out of luck soon. Anyway, let's run over to the... We need a faster way to get from here to there. I guess I can, well, maybe cross the waterfall and then still slosh through the water. Yeah, I have to go up on my deck to get across. Anyway, I logged in a while back and I found pheasants everywhere. So I had to go back in and double up on all of the fences here. And I found eight pheasants. I don't know how many we had originally. I hope I found them all. But... Which means this could actually go away now. As long as... Yeah, can you go away? No, I'll leave you. Alright. So, yeah. That would just be a big door going in and a big door going out and really tall fences everywhere. But we do have lots of eggs and we need to think about doing some cooking soon. I'm gonna go visit that island. It'd be nice to have some, some good uh, food to, to boost the experience. We'll grab all of these... And all of you guys. There's some feathers. There's more feathers. What else? Is that it? That's a good haul out of both of them. Uh, inside here. I haven't put any more feed into either one. It's not apparently it's not actually necessary. They don't have any kind of a of a health bar. So and I saw something in another video. I was watching someone and they went through and did the delete on the chest and it went away it gave me four wood back oh I thought it was going to give me a, a chest somewhere let's see here what would that even be under if it was here it would be under storage so if it was here it would be right there so we still don't have the ability to make that kind of a chest Hmm. We do have the ability to make the upgrade station that I spent all the last episode not even noticing that little exclamation point right there. Yeah, uh-huh. That, that just happens. That's, that is, you know, YouTuber tunnel vision. When you're concentrating on narrating and talking, you're, that part of your brain isn't looking at all the details. It's focused right on the center and trying to think of what do I talk about next. So let's think about doing that. You are right there. We need linen. Uh, well, there is something else to show you. In fact, I didn't even notice. It might have even popped into view while we were over there at the birds. I did a little planting. <laughs> well little is probably an understatement. I went around the perimeter of half the island, cleaned out all the trees, all the bushes, all the shrubberies, and planted all kinds of stuffs. So you are sugarcane? Yeah, some blueberries, some corn, some tomatoes, some... I'm not sure. I want to say carrots, but I, no, that's carrots. Your potatoes, I think. Or corn, carrots. Yeah, I'm thinking a watermelon, but might be the, uh, the pumpkin. No, I think I had one watermelon. And you guys are more of the, well, those look like leeks, but you are the garlic and or chives down in here we've got all of the um, flax which I got a comment telling me that it's 
it prematurely tells you it's time to cut it down. You really do need to wait for the flowers to show up. So we're waiting for these guys to show up in order to cut those in order to make the upgrade station. Hmm. And I wanted to upgrade the tools before we went and attacked anybody else so we can potentially get more of the... Uh, of the other kinds of the fibers if that is how you get them so I guess I've got a little bit of a waiting game going on for more crops to grow hmm well what is there to do until then and are there any more pheasants about so yeah door going in and out now both ends and we still have Connor and he is a pheasant Look at that. Boy, I thought I had a different kind of bird. <clears throat> the babies didn't look anything like the babies that I've seen before. I guess being uh, all white feathers really uh, threw me off. And the screech. I didn't remember their, their, their noise sounding like that. So you guys aren't just popping just to surprise me, right? No, nah, we're still waiting. Okay. Oh, dead end. So I guess we could go play with some cooking. See if I can find some combinations of uh, oh, high HP meals. Um, <clears throat> I didn't even check. Plants, plate, it does go there. Okay. So where does a granary go then? That just kind of looks odd now. Maybe that all moves into this area. <clears throat> which case the fireplace could almost well it's gonna stick out just as far anyway hmm anyway let's see what we can do here so combine three and and cook them oh let's see let's throw in some flour let's throw in a pumpkin uh, we haven't made sugar let's do that um, Oh, I am making sugar. I popped that in. Okay. <clears throat> and while I'm out here thinking about it, I popped this in just before I started. Yeah. One leaf makes one dirt. Five dirts makes a planter, and I went through a lot of dirt. Boy, I did. So, with the sugar, let's put in some sugar some flour and hmm pumpkin don't oh it's cooking F so if I didn't do anything would it cook just very slowly I don't know I'm hoping that makes some kind of a pumpkin pie or pumpkin bread or or what else could you do with that Guess we'll find out here in a moment. Pumpkin pie. Ooh. Uh, 36 HP. Nice. Now, if I did that with blueberries, what would happen? You and you and blueberries. And then before we... Well, I was going to say before we leave, we could just leave something cooking without holding the F and walk away, but... When I come back later, probably a day later, thinking about it, I wonder if it'd just be burnt to a crisp. So I'll have to wait and see. So what other combinations make sense? Put all the fruit together and see if it's like a ooh, a blueberry pie. Mmm. Okay. Fruits together. Are there more choices than this? Oh, it's saving them for us. I was wondering how I was going to go back and remember this stuff. So, okay. Um, a watermelon and a blueberry. And what? Water? Make a juice of some kind? All right, what do we have? A savory smoothie. Ooh, they've done a lot with this. They've, they've been having some, some fun. What do you do with leaves? A salad. Oh, and tomatoes and onions, milk, corn, carrots. 
I think we're onions. Does that do anything? What's it gonna be? A veggie skewer. Now, what was that again? Oh, I have to take it. There we go. So you were... Oh, I don't want to make one. Oh, and this time it's just tomatoes. I did onions or garlic last time. Hmm. Now, could I pull them out halfway? I could. Okay. So that veggie skewer... That was a potato in there, too. So potato, carrot, and onion would all make the same thing. Okay. No, I was looking for... A, I had leaves in there, didn't I? I was looking for a salad. Okay, let's try maybe one more thing. Egg and flour would probably give you the same thing we've already made with it. Flour and sugar. Yeah. Corn. And... What? What would corn go with? A soup? I bet there's no meats. I don't know. Can you make goat stew? I don't know if that's a thing. There's only 12 spaces unless another row shows up. Hmm. What can you make with corn? Milk. And... What would you throw in with that? Potato. Let's make some kind of a creamy soup. So I guess this is like stoking the fire, like blowing on the flame. I don't know. Oh, what are you? A soup. Veggies and liquid. Okay. Well, we're going to stop there. Those are all in my inventory now. Uh, right up in... Oh, you... Oh, you're in the food part. Good. Okay. So you are the 36 and you are the 30. The skewer is a 24. The soup is an 18. And the smoothie is an 18. Okay. So we go in with the pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie is good. And what's over here? Oh, we've, we've learned about sugar. Mm -hmm. Mix it with flour and fruits to make delicious desserts. Aha. Okay. Dirty water's down there. So let's drop off the sugar. And... I don't really need some of these things. So the sugar can go up there. The eggs can go up there. You could actually be... Well... What the hey? Let's just get that eaten and out of there. Gives us a little boost. Um, you, that's right, from here, you have to have it memorized. It doesn't let you see the pop-up anymore. It's unfortunate it's not in this view, too. But you were among the lower numbers. These were the best. You were among the lower, and you were in the middle. We'll toss you in there. Um, you're down there. Arrows we'll use eventually. In fact, for that matter, we had arrows... In this basket. Yeah, there's 20 arrows. Let's play with the... I'm still waiting for stuff to grow. I don't think anything looks different down there. Let's take a look at the bow. Right there. Craft you with that craft. Okay. Bow. Boy, what do I want to sacrifice? Um, tab. Axe pick. Building, poking, you're my floater, and scything. This one is probably going to be used the least. Probably is, but I usually have my bow right next to my sword. Hmm. <clears throat> Am I going to have to re memorize everything? You can go. Oh, if I just click you, you just disappear. Okay. So that means I can't just move you over. I got to undo all of that. Great. Bow. And then, axe, pick, hammer, pokey thing, and, oh, I'm not actually moving them. <laughs> Alright, so if I shift click, there it goes. Nope. Then you go back, shift click. Okay. Um, I guess floater's going to be eight now. Scythe will be seven. Okay. 
floater will be milk or torch. I'll leave torch in there for otherwise, for, for times like this. Yeah. All right, we have a bow. We just need some sunlight. So I'm going to go up, bring the sun back. Okay, so let's see what's going on out here. Do we have any plants to harvest? I don't see any blueberries on there. I don't see any corn. Uh, seven? Yeah. So let's see if this symbol pops up. wonder if it's number of days for Forest Radio to harvest or if it's actual screen time. Yeah, nothing's changed here. Except for these guys. And they do give me one. I mean, it's... Did it? It didn't this time. Interesting. Last time it did that, it did give it to me. Well, that's a bummer. So, let's plant. No flax left. Okay. So, we have that few plants. It doesn't work. Alright, so we have to give that time. Let's play with the bow. Can we build a target? Don't think so. So, what should we use as a target? Um, got a good expanse right over where the sheep and or llamas may go eventually. Because with the amount of poop I just found on the goat pen, I don't think I can handle another group of poopers in there with them. But this area here could be another pen. Yeah, which means this tree's got to go and got to put a, a gate right there. But until then, this tree is now a target. So, two. Let's try... R for reload? No. Uh, right click? No. Left click? No. How does the bow work? Provide good shooting distance at an average pace. That tells me nothing. Um, I do have arrows. Uh, can we loose by any bow? Can I put you... I don't know. Equip. E. Ah. And are you officially equipped? You are. Okay. Two. Ah. There we go. So left click. Right click. Nothing. Okay. Can you be recovered? Doesn't look like it. So I've got 19 left. And you are now decor. Uh, put you away. No sense of anything. Can I delete you? No. You just exist now. Okay. Well, let's go a little further and see if there's any arrow drop. Um, hmm. What is... Where's a place that I want to look at an arrow... For the rest of the game. <laughs> um, right over the top of the door up there. Alright. Okay, I'm going to aim for dead center of... What is that called? The mantle? It looks like no arrow drop at all. Let's see. Can I even get there from here? Not really. Let's put two away. I'll go this way. No, it was a little low, and it's at the angle I shot it at. Okay, well, we'll see if that's there next time. I don't know if it will be. I wonder what happens when it goes into an enemy. Now, most of the power moves have to do with, like, this. All right, let's look at this one. Up slash. Boom, boom, boom. I don't suppose you can be using the bow when something like that is used. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Uh, there's our fog again. There it is. So no matter where I set it, it just eventually goes away because I'm messing with the settings. When I come back to the settings, it, it finds a way to come back again. Uh, was it... Well, let's just play with the fog for a minute. No, there. It was the render distance? Cloud resolution... Now, quality, 
now. There, I went to medium. But go right back to... Oh, so low is failing on me. So render distance high and ultra. Well, we'll do that. Though I think it was on higher ultra last time when I got into the settings and made it go away when I went down to medium. Anyway. Oh, it's coming back. It's coming back. <laughs> so... I can't make any more linen, so I can't make the upgrade station, so I can't put the potion onto the sword, so I can't get the special stuffs. So let's just go kick some enemy butt for on the little island. Just have something to do. I'm trying to find the little island. There's this guy, which is actually quite far away. Let's fly over to somewhere. Right there. So we want to go... One of these two. Uh, I see it's the, the fogs are causing the problem. So let's spin around. I'm not attached to anything. Well, I kind of was close, but I, I think I spun away from it. Though I've noticed that if I keep spinning, the tail end of this island does have some pretty significant tail swing. So let's go up. It does bang into it, then it throws me around. So let's go up and over. And that's right. I was told in the comments to hit F. So we've got numbers that show up that supposedly tell us the amount of stress, maybe, that the island, that the, that the cloth is going through. Let's pull out of the rise. Let's go forward. Oh, which ones are being harmed or overwhelmed. Interesting. Aha. Uh -huh. I don't know what the 40 and the rudder means. These guys. Let's go up. Okay. They do change color a little bit. So, I'm sure red is bad, but I don't know why. So, are you saying we need more sails to account to ease the load? We need to spread them out? I'm not sure what I'm seeing there. I do know I've got one big island here. And I've got another one somewhere. I want to say it's over there, but... Is that an island coming into view, or is that a... A... Uh, Tornado-like thing that we're only seeing partially rendered in don't know let's drop back down again and let's go look at the map so we have one near us and one a lot further away and it shows the sails at this end of the map and that little island there but we're definitely going the other direction see where the little sails on that thing you'd think the sails would be on this side over here as we are heading I'm actually... Why can't I climb up? There we go. Heading toward that island. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. So we're alongside that one and we're heading toward that one. I see. So which is the smaller? I guess it's this one. They're both kind of large, though. Okay. Grab you. Pull into here. Let's get a little closer. Play with this. Duck! Whoa! <laughs> yeah, I'm getting stuck at the top here now. It doesn't want to... It's like it's interacting with that torch. I'm afraid to leap, though. Alright, so let's just get in here a little bit closer. I'm still going down. That's what's going on. Let's level off here. Or at least, let's go up for a little bit. Then we'll level off. We're still turning. and our, We're still at full sail, even though it's not showing. Oh, that's right. Just got to think and hopefully fix that some with their next update. Then it dawned on me. They did update. So we are in version 1.34 now. So the furniture update that I talked about a couple episodes ago is here. There's nothing new for us to find in our current set of options, though. So it's stuff we have to find. So learning stones apparently are going to unlock it for us. At least that's my guess. Okay, we are in this area. Let's go through the f the foggy air here and see if the flax popped. 
It was the first thing that I planted, so it should be the first thing that ripens, assuming that they all ripen at the same rate. Nothing looks different in there. They still have the same symbol, even though nothing's happened. Okay, so let's... We have a meal on us already. We can go ahead and just eat that. Um, that was the pumpkin pie. Uh, e. And let's throw in some water. Boy, there's a big boost. What does water do? Extra stamina. And it seems to boost the health or hit points as well. Huh. Well, I'm going to call that good. <clears throat> we are going to use this guy. And let's just rush over there and see what happens. We're over here, right? Yeah. Right over our sails. So let's slow down and take a tour. What do we actually have here? Why does this look so different? Is it not spawning in? All the mushrooms and whatnot aren't here. Oh, there was talk about nodes showing up. And if you hold it, and boom! No, that didn't work. But I didn't have time to think. But there are nodes that are showing up on the islands that will grow and progress, but not start off as a full-blown infected island, if I remember right. Saw a picture of that. Right now I'm looking for wherever that might be, as well as which of these are. Now let's see if we can do this. You're supposed to be able to hold it until it turns blue. Nope, that didn't work. Yeah, power moves. They're not my thing. Oh, there was one. Hit the space bar? I kind of did both. I let go and hit the space bar at the same time. What are you? Oh, you're a, an animal that has been infected. Let's get rid of all potential enemies first. Is that one of the red enemies? Yeah. There we go. Oh, that didn't work. <laughs> Hold the space bar a bunch of times. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> no, go, 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 go. Okay, back to old school. Hit, duck, hit, duck. Okay. Power moves. Alright, so what else is here? There must be more enemies. There must be a node. There must be something that's causing all of this. I don't think it's just a matter of taking all those out. I'll open these later. And I want to like, once I find out what they actually are, what's causing all this. I'm not seeing anything else. You. Yeah. Oh, just keep clicking. Okay. Still just regular fiber. Not the fancy stuff. You? Nothing in here. That goes quite deep. Nothing over here. I'm confused. I wonder if flying around here causes that. Seems to happen randomly, but there must be something more to it. A little bit higher. Heck, let's. Oh, missed that one. I got to thinking, let's go higher yet. So let's get up in here. Okay. So none of you guys are enemies. I don't see anything down in here. And there's one of the rocks that are trapped. Like I saw on our island once while I was doing some stuff. And you are... Now? I'm not seeing a node. I'm not seeing what's causing this. Uh, there was this deep ditch I didn't go down. Where is that? Down in here? Yeah. I wonder if there is a, a uh, tunnel where it might be located. Bones. Are you hiding in here? There's two enemies right there. Um, no? No enemies. I thought these guys would pop out and say hi. Wow, I've never seen this island before. This is a 
deep tunnel. Are those boom booms? I think we're getting closer to the node, aren't we? I'm waiting for one of these to pop up and say hi. Wow, this is quite the tunnel system. Whoa. Okay, this was exciting. <laughs> yeah. Um, any red caps that are going to turn into bad guys around me? I don't want to add them to the three once I start striking this guy. No, they seem to be not here. All right. Let's do this. Okay, over here. Hold it down. Oh, there you are. And boom. Don't know that that did what I wanted to. Ooh. Hey, I can do two at a time. That's good. Swipes through all of them. That it? What are... Oh, okay. I thought you were forming a new node. Okay, so this was in the process of spreading to everywhere else. And there's another way in. There was a back door. Boy, this is a cool island. Okay, well, let's search this one for a while. Yeah, would have been nice to have gotten the, uh, the upgraded fibers from that. Maybe next episode we'll get there. Was there anything else in here? To anything new. I do hear the learning stone, and I don't think we've been this way. There you are. Okay, what do we got? The leaf lantern. Oh, we're going to find all of the furniture one at a time. Well, good. Not going to run out of things to uh, new research anytime soon. Okay. Now, not seeing anything coming by that's different. Boy, there are... Wow. That's a lot of bones. Okay, I'm going to have to spend time really looking down, aren't I? Just depending on my peripheral vision to find things. But, yeah, we're going to have to search. Okay. Wood. Uh, bird food. Cloth. And another pick. Stone pick, it looks like. Yep, stone pick. I could dismantle you. That work? I don't know. It's still there. Hold. Click. I don't know. It's not working. Oh, that's an E, not an R. Okay. Okay. That yeah. That that works better. <laughs> Okay, so, um, you know, I could be even smarter and turn the torch on. Yeah, now that wanted to go somewhere. No, it doesn't. That's coal, but we don't, I don't think we're hurting on coal. I got quite a bit of it stored. So nothing back in... Oh, will you look at that. No, that's the same one. There's a little bit of a circle here. I don't know what just happened there. But let's go back with the torch and rule all this one out. So anything else showing up? Bones or... Yeah, we'll hit that one next. Let's go this way. I mean, those look different. The red stalks. I don't recall seeing that before. There's a gather. That's stones. All right, let's run the perimeter of this place one more time. Any new plants that I'm not aware of? There's lots of little sparkles, but they're coming off of the torch. So that's bones? Gather. Bones. Okay, good. Need these to make more. Oh, these are stones, headstones. These are graves. Oh, I don't know if I should have picked those up. A little disrespectful there. So, we took the left turn last time. Let's take the other branch. And verify that nothing's been missed. But this is quite the tunnel system. 
rocks. Windstone or learning stone. And rocks. Okay. Back out. Find that fork in the road. Right there. Going this way now. Sounds like wind. Like. Oh, we got another fork. So try this one. Sounds like it's storming outside. Okay, same chest. Eight. So we could take the wood from that, or we could just chop down a tree. So we've been here. So go to the other branch this time. This way. Um, I haven't been looking for these. Yeah. Oh boy. Probably a bunch of those in here. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. But... So that's where they are from, officially. Yeah. I guess they're just decoration. Not any decoration I really care to use, but... Could grab all of these guys. Bunch of them all in one place. Kind of convenient. So this is what I'll tend to do after an episode. Go back to a place we've been and clean up all the little stuffs like this and kind of refill the uh, the building materials. Okay, so we've seen this part, and there's more building materials to gather, but. We did that later. Nothing else here. Jump. Up. Let's go to the top. Oops. That wasn't the boost. That's the boost. And back over here. Back down. And we'll search the island properly, including seeing who these guys are. What were you? It's a weird little horn. I honestly don't know. My first thought was sheep. Is it like a ram's horn? I'm not sure. Bones. That one didn't make it. What are you? I'm thinking sheep. It's just that's not the horn I expected to see on them. I can't pick you up, right? I can pick up. Uh, right there. I can take you to our island and make a place to put sick animals and cure you eventually maybe that's a thing let's continue searching we know the top plateau has somebody something <clears throat> what else is around here i could definitely use more hay so that's something else i'll do between episodes come back and get all the ferns all of these guys and there is one other plant. There's like three, maybe four plants that will let me do this. Otherwise, oops, try that way. Uh, next level looks like here. Let's take this lower side first. Anybody over here? Any more secrets and treasures? Okay. Now I guess we'll make the loop. I'm guessing this island is too big to fly. And no, I'm not building a third house. Not gonna build another one. But boy, this island does offer a lot of options. But yeah, I have a feeling that if I were to stick a helm on here. Now, can you stick a helm on more than one island at a time? Well, let's say you've already got a helm on another one. I don't know. I don't think I've tried that. So you're there. There's a lot of animals on this island. Hmm. Okay. Yep, I'm seeing a lot of them. You are bones. Yep, more over there. So we came down this and I went that way. Now I went around that direction though.
Nothing up here. Can't really see down there. I see pumpkins. I saw something white. You're nothing. Okay. You guys aren't anything. Okay. Grab the pumpkins and head back up. Let's go play with our floating rock. So, hello. Okay, I can pass right through you. Good. Pumpkins. Nothing in there. Yeah, we get a lot of hay off of this island. There's another layer down there. Wow, there's a lot to search. Now, this might be the pathway I've already taken when I said let's go around the ring here. So, let's go back up onto this level. Okay, so we got three over here. Bones. Bones. And bones. These guys didn't make it. Pumpkins there. This level is where we came down before. Okay. So from here I saw purple off in the distance over here? No, but I'll grab the pumpkins. That pumpkin pie was powerful. I'm going to make more of that. And we just came from here. Because I landed next to this stone. So where were the other ones? Okay. Maybe I saw the same three twice. Let's go up here. Yeah, so it's just you on top? I think so. Okay. Well, with that then... Yeah, I'm not seeing... Let me head over here one more time. I, I missed this pumpkin, so... Maybe it was off over here. No. Okay, so I think it's time to... I think I'll drive the island over. And get it in position then we'll we'll take the potential sheep and put them somewhere not sure where at this point this plateau here what do we do with our viewing deck kind of a neat area should this be fenced off and full of animals could be Okay, I think I'm in place, but boy, the game just got really laggy. Hopefully it clears itself up, otherwise I may have to restart. But I think that's about as close as I'm going to get there. Yeah, that looks good. Okay. Fly up. And let's fly around and see if I missed anybody. Any more purple out there? I thought I looked two different directions and saw groups of purple as I was running through, but it's possible I got turned around. One thing about flying, you once you look down, you get about two seconds, and then it resets itself every time. So if you're trying to look at one area, you got to keep moving the the mouse in order to force it to not auto reset back to looking forward again. Wish that, that wasn't a thing. I don't see any others, so I'm going to drop in here and grab this guy and pick you up. And once we get that cure figured out. You'll be among the first to be cured. Where is our island? I'm thinking it's just kind of straight that way, but... Let's see. There's a pumpkin, but I guess we'll go without that one. Where is our island? There you are. Okay, so is this the right level? Um, I think I'm heading down into here. Looks like it. Yeah. Jump! There we go. Bring you in here. Let's not let the other ones get infected. And I guess for now we'll just lay you out here in the uh, in the meadow where you can be seen. All right, you just you just sleep there. So a cure. So what do I actually have out here? Um, where would I put that? I put that here. So you're shaped like that. You're not the same thing. Okay. So let's build temporarily a floor uh, there 
on the ground. And I guess I can go back to auto now. There, there, there. And let's see, one wall just to give us some height. Right? There's fine. Well, let me go over here. Like that. And then give me roof. Flat. Okay. And get rid of the wall. And build. Which is five now. Did it all? Yep. Then let's grab a post. I'm liking these posts now. But I could do something less dramatic. Oh, the posts are all together now. Look at that. All the different kinds of posts. Okay, well, that's good. So I'll put you... Actually, let's go to the top. I think that's easier. Right there. There. Close enough. <laughs> wow, I can't jump in. Okay, stairs. That'll do. Pick you up. Bring you into here. And put two more posts in. Just so that it looks right. Build, post, move over to that guy. Now, if I start at the bottom, I guess that works too. That might even actually be easier. Right there and there. Okay. There's a quick little, yeah, triage structure. We'll, we'll go with that. All right, so we beat up a bunch of bad guys and got the the, uh, the island back. Any chance we have blueberries? Do not have blueberries. So what's it going to take for these guys to ripen? Let's run through here. I need flax. I need linen. There we go. And nothing. Okay. So, they said they redesigned some of the islands. I'm hearing a windstone, or a learning stone. The other island's way over there. Is there a new tunnel in our island that I don't know about? Or did this reactivate? Did they reactivate all of them? They may have. Oh. That must be it. The leaf chair. Okay. So, all of these learning stones have been reactivated. Well, can't. I, I don't want to go invade the other island until we've got an upgraded tool. So, let's think long and hard about leaf chairs. Build. Furnishings are apparently over here with storage. I'm not seeing it. What am I looking at here? Oh, they're right there. Okay, I was search. I was thinking it was at the end of the list. You are a leaf chair. You are a leaf lantern. You can place down anywhere. Oh, there's multiple styles. So, you sit on things? Okay. Um, three. Can I hang you up on a roof? Though, technically, the flame would burn it, but... Oh, I see. So there's one, two, three, four. Hmm. So it wants to sit on something. I thought this would be more of a hanging thing. But apparently I can just lop it onto a wall like that. Okay. So you take a coal, a plank, and some of that fabric. So I can make, or did I make, 
the loom will make that fabric like crazy. So at one point, yeah, I just said, oh, a buttload of leaves in so we never have to worry about that fabric again <laughs> let's light this place up build lantern i like this one so you now does that go through the wall let's put you into that third level right there there and run outside well you peek through a little bit I can't make you come away from the wall. You're just going to go up and down. But if I did this at every joint, we would probably have a well-lit room if it doesn't suddenly go foggy on me. Yep, here comes the fog. All right, you're going there. I'm thinking that may be enough spacing. It's like the, the torches really don't light up very far. So even that doesn't do much. Ah, oh, it's a shame. So let's pop you on the roof and see what happens. So, yeah, the light doesn't come back into the room. So it's going to have to sit on something. And I don't have something easy to sit it on. It, it casts quite a shadow underneath itself. It really does. So what do you do? Do you put a light... It just wants to sit on the floor. If I put you up here... No, no. Hmm. Okay, that's better. So if I put you at places like that... Okay. Uh, going down the staircase... Kind of. So it's it's not perfect yet. I'm sure they're going to be working on tweaking this and making it work right. But you know, either that or I'm going to suddenly see yeah 35 uh, frames per second up there. Out here, 36. More objects I place in the game. I'm sure we're going to start to get a penalty. Yeah. Just trying to make it look bright enough to see when we're moving around through the video. Yeah, I'm killing time right now. <laughs> what goes in here, I wonder? Hmm. Killing time, waiting for flax to grow. Okay, what are we looking like now? So even in the middle of the night, we can pretty much see what's going on. Yeah, I think so. I think the lighting looks better out of these than those. But I... Let's see, over here I put them on little posts, little pillars, little logs. That's what I've been doing with these guys to try and lighten them up. This one, it does not let me go up on this anymore. Don't know if you're the cause or not. Nope, something's gone wrong here. So let's rebuild the stairs and see if that fixes it. Yeah, that's better. Something went wrong with the stairs when it when it uh, spawned back in. Okay, so yeah. I really wanted to upgrade tools today. Oh. No, well, we got flowers, so at least we're seeing another stage. Okay. Let's see what else we got going on. Any ears of corn in there? Not really. Carrots. I don't see any orange showing up. Do have blossoms here, though. On the melon. Whichever melon that was. Down here? Still waiting. Okay. Let's run around and look at our original pumpkins. I think I left those in place. Yeah. So they're still sitting over here. we got some melons to gather. Frames are down in the 20s now. So that was the choice I had to make. Do I put the planters against 
the wall around the island and then put a walkway on the outside? Or do I put the planters on the outside and the walkway on the inside? I got to thinking, you know, I can get a nice level surface on the outside by building, by putting the planters on the walkway and then just walk on the, uh, on the dirt. And I decided to go ahead and take all the dirt up, though now I don't really have to. I want, I needed dirt to make these out of, so I pulled all the topsoil off. But now we've, if we can make dirt out of leaves, and that's just like free dirt. So I could go back in and, you know, pop this stuff back in and make it look a little better. There we go. Yeah, I like that. Might patch with soil. Ow. I see it's every other one. Problem is I can't get I can't scythe these things down. So it does get a little bit interesting. Every other one doesn't do anything unless it's happening up there. So I've got to do it over here, which puts it into the planter. Well, it's behaving. Okay. Yeah, if I can try to... I don't want... Oh, that just like popped. Whoa. Okay. Maybe it liked that I was putting the soil back. <laughs> okay. Patch with soil. So some of them are returning. It could be that some are going to return with time. I've seen some of these bald spots turn back into grass after a while. So let's rush over here and see if we have flax. Yep, all these just came in. And they came in. Okay, so scythe you guys. There's only one per. Okay, and we'll replant before we leave here. Nice that I don't have to do one plant at a time. Okay. So, oh, I have to till it. And tilling was tough. Oh, boy, I wish it was daylight right now. Here, hold on. Yeah, it's much easier to see when the sun's out, though. You still have this fogginess to the air. But tilling was tough because it wanted to put the soil back in. Which then put a bunch of the weeds back in. Oh, I can't pull the soil back out. Okay. But if you get an angle outward, then it will till. And it turns out that if you... The lower down you get, the more you... Of the other ones you till at the same time. So... Yeah, bonus there. There we go. So if you can get into that position... I've never tried diagonal. I wonder if I could have done several at a time. Um... Not wrong diagonal. Anyway, fire you across and you. Okay, so that's all of them. Looks, nope, what missed one right there. Where are you? Can't get you from this angle. Till, there you are. So, yeah, when I took this out, it wants me to put it back. So that almost overrides things. Let's get up in the air and put the... Oh, the seeds, you guys, into the floater spot. Number eight. Okay. And, yeah, I got this mixed up a couple episodes ago. So now that it's in my hand, I still have to hit E, but I don't have to go through and, and pick again which seed I want. So that's where I messed it up that one time. I wish I could just walk and spam. I can kind of. Yeah, that kind of works. That it? Nope. The triangles are, they make it look good, but you only get one plant in them. So it's almost, yeah, you get three out of the round ones. With the triangles, you only get one. So kind of a jip there. And there's a lot more planting to go through and, and take advantage of. But is there anything else in here we really, really need at this moment? I don't think so. I'll grab you. Okay. Uh, if I just click, will it? Transfer the scythe over, it won't. So seven, take out all of you. Okay. Oh. Oh, I can gather. Okay. Yeah. So let's not put him back in there. In fact, I'll just leave that. Yeah. 
anyway so i may redo where some of these things are kind of ran out of room but there will be more planting beds going in so we can get more variety out there um seven away let's go up and make some linen real quick in our oddly green house now which is kind of foggy <laughs> and let's see we gotta run the brake first so toss all of you in there and let's go ahead and speed this up Is that getting smaller? I think it is. Yep, it is. Oh, it's getting fast. Oh, missed it. Yeah, there's a point at which there isn't much advantage compared to the risk. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm getting tired. All right, one per pass. There we go. And last one. All right, let that thing just run for a while. If I pull out, I'm pretty sure it goes back to slow. So you've got to do it this way. But, you know, I think 34 is enough. Yeah, just let you run. All right, Loom, toss you in there. And let's make some linen. And we'll upgrade. And we'll use the upgraded tool next time. Oh, there it is. Nine... We'll stop at 10. Great. You just continue working. Okay, down to the research table. Which is where we put our upgrade tool. Research. You're here? Where are you? I don't remember now. There you are. Upgrade station. Right there. Pop you in. That took away linen and stone. It didn't give me a third sub. -item. I'm guessing that's when I did this one is when we got that or when we used it. That's what it was. So select tool. I want the bone sword. You are 27 to 40. The bone... I thought I had a bone door kip. I don't. So we'll go with you. Apply coat or install a trinket. Oh, that's right. There's trinkets now. So apply coat. Um... Nothing popped to say something happened. Do I need a trinket too? Tier 2. Okay. Trinkets. Let's think about that. Um, everything I have to make a trinket with is in a basket, so it should be available. The obsidian. Two of... Oh, I need two to learn to use this one. When installed on a tool through an upgrade station, strikes frequently stagger enemies. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Drop you. Linen. Three of them makes a book. A linen bandage. Oh, let's do that. At least one of them. Okay, I'm out of linen. So what about this guy? Did we learn anything with him? If we did, he would be here. Okay, I need another opal. Deal vastly more damage to resources. So that must be something you put on your axe. You, we could make. Uh, strikes are faster while in high winds. That's probably not going to use be used very often. And you, strikes frequently stagger enemies. So you, uh, extra strike can be performed while airborne. Okay. Yeah, that's that's like a combo. I'm gonna fail that one miserably. We'll put it on it. We'll just we'll do it. Just to see the process of upgrading. But I don't guarantee I'm gonna make that one work. Select tool, apply trinket. You Okay. Apparently that got done. And what are you? You're my new bandage. Okay. And I can't put you on a hot bar, can I? I can't. We can take you away. Um, so I can't hit eight while in battle. I have to stop and go find it. Um, tool, right there. You are tier two. You're tier two, which means bone. But did I actually apply the stuff? I did not. Do I need it on me? Okay, tool, you, apply coat. Maybe I didn't actually click it. 
Okay. So now I have slightly more damage to corrupt monsters and gather intact samples from them. Okay. So we're at that hour point easily right now. Probably a little past after I do my editing. So I think next time we're going to attack... I think there's one more island out in front of us, right? Let's try that hop and skip again. There we go. Let's just get up in the air. Um, I thought we were heading... No, we were heading toward and then we backed off. So I think you're right over there. Yeah, in between those, those whirlwinds. Okay, crash boom. So we're heading there next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you later. Bye-bye. Thank you.